and welcome to Blue Box Berlin's early edition. I'm Tom McKenzie in London. Here's what's coming up on today's programme. Energy impasse, EU efforts to strike deals on price caps for gas and Russian crude stall as divisions push approval of some measures into mid-December. Oil trades a little shake. COVID alarm, China's daily case count tops 30,000. That's for the first time with parts of Beijing seeing panic buying as officials struggle to contain outbreaks across the nation. And Black Friday Blue, retailers brace for muted shopping results while thousands of Amazon warehouse workers across 40 countries plan protests over pay and working conditions. Let's check in on these markets then. It is a little bit muted. There is a bit of lack of direction, of course. Traders coming back to their desks in the US for a partial day of trading. You have got money moving in to US trade. You've seen that across the curve. Yields down. Of course, these equity markets then. You're seeing losses in European stocks around two tenths. The certain context is you've seen a grind higher since around the middle of August, so six weeks of gains. But taking some profit, at least on the margins of European stocks today, that two tenths of eight percent. S&P futures looking to hold above that four thousand level, gaining at two tenths of a percent. The markets reopen. What's up guys, this is your boy James, aka 68J, coming to you guys on this beautiful Monday afternoon. What's up family, how you guys doing? Before we get started guys, let me just first say um, how sorry we all, we all are to hear about uh, Bulla Sharon's husband. Um, that's definitely not the way that I wanted to uh, start the show off, uh, hearing that, that that's just so unfortunate. And my heart and prayers go out to that poor young lady. Um, yeah, so if you guys can, make sure that you send your love and support and prayers uh, to Bullish Sharon. Um, I literally saw that uh, maybe about, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes ago, and it just, you know, anyone losing their significant other, uh, especially when you have someone that you, um, you know, that you're partnered with, like with myself and my wife, and I just couldn't imagine uh, losing my soulmate or my partner, my best friend, so, um, you know, much love to... Bullish Sharon and uh, our prayers go out with you, sis. I'm so sorry again to hear that. Um, and so for those of you guys who didn't see it, see it uh, Bullish Sharon posted that in a group. Um, and so definitely, that's right, Laurel. Uh, Laurel, just uh, our prayers go out to you, uh, Sharon. And I know it's been an a ongoing struggle and battle. Um, so uh, definitely prayers with you, sis. And, and uh, sorry to hear that. Uh, let me... Um, Go through the group real quick and say hello to everyone. Bullish PDP Real, Mr. Dependable himself. That's right, my brother. Uh, thoughts and prayers going out to Bullish Sharon. That's right. Uh, Laurel Jack says condolences. Shane Sullivan. What's up, Bullish Pete? Uh, Bullish PDP Real, Crypto for Life fan. Appreciate you. Dominic Scott, my brother. What's up, brother? This is one of my old school boys from when we first started out in the journey. Um, one of the guys, first guys I met in a prior group. Great person. Amazing. Uh, friend, and uh, we've had the opportunity to talk not only through social media or Telegram, but also on the phone, FaceTime, the whole nine. So, what's up, my brother? Dominique Scott, my brother. What's up, man? Uh, crypto tro Trophy. Is it? Is it? I got to get that right. Because I know it's not Trophy, because you, you corrected me one time. <laughs> so, is it Tropi or Crypto Tropi or Crypto Tropi? How do, I, how do I say that? Is it Crypto Tropi? If I'm saying that right, Crypto Tropi, give me a, um, a yay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it's crypto tropy. Uh, Shayla Sullivan says hello, uh, my wife, my beautiful wife. Jeanette says hope everyone had an amazing Christmas. Shows a love and the and the prayer hands for um, Bullish Sharon. Timeless travel, my sister. Crypto OG, what's up, my brother? Timeless travel with the um, Happy Boxing Day. That is Happy Boxing Day. 
Is any matches going on today, uh, Crypto OG? So, uh, uh, timeless travel uh, with some great um, uh, advice this morning. We got some stuff that we're working on. We want to we wanna have some different... Um, things that we talk about on the channel. So we're gonna be we're gonna be going over things, guys, like different days. It might be, you know, take me back Tuesdays or something, you know, <laughs> can't really we're still discussing it, but you know, deep dives, you know, Wednesdays or whatever, whatever it's gonna be, you know, just certain things that we do to keep everything uh um fresh. But then also have, you know, maybe like fear and FUD Fridays or something, you know, where we where we talk about what's going on in the market the you know not just you know things just can't always be talked about and you know oh this is everything's great going great because things aren't always going great and so we want to we want to keep everybody up to date we want to talk about all the great things that are going on and obviously but we also have to be realistic at at, at uh at uh certain times as well and talk about the fear the fud the realities of what's going on and so there's some things i put on my twitter but i reached out to some of the top uh, admin and mods uh, in our in our private group and and uh, and we brought up those things like what can we do to 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 be different? I think one of the things that Timeless talked about is and, and it's one of the things that I don't even try to do. It's, it's just who I am, and that is you know we here we want to be authentic, we want to be real, we want to be fresh, we want to be different, we want to be uh, you know and all those things wrapped up with integrity and and. Uh, but this this is a family, guys, and I take family very serious. And so I'm, I'm just let me just say how lucky and blessed and fortunate I am to have such amazing family members uh, around me, like Dominique Scott, like Timeless Travel, like Oculus Dora, Dore. Let's see, let me I correct myself. Dore, Shane Sullivan. That's right, my beautiful queen Jeanette McFadden, and all the other amazing, amazing members like Crypto OG, Bullish PDP Real, my man, Mr. Dependable, all you guys, I definitely appreciate you guys. And then obviously those who may not be on right now, I know David right now is in the field. David, I don't know what I'd do without that guy. Uh, he's out in the field right now. Uh, it's Tropics without the, oh, okay. It's Tropics, so Crypto Tropics without the CS. Oh, okay. It was a typo, and it just oh, and I, okay, so <laughs> okay, so I gotta know that because then see if I say I'm gonna say crypto tropics from now on, and then people are gonna think I can't read. It's okay, that's all right because I do that sometimes anyway. <laughs> I always tell people it's okay if you if you talk ebonics, it's okay if you don't know how to spell every word, but if you're good at cash and checks, which which I've been good for over 25 years, and that's all that matters, cash and checks, adding commas, counting zeros, that's okay. With that being said, I got you, Crypto. So if I do it again, my apologies in advance because I'm seeing one thing, but I got to remember my head, Crypto Tropics, like Tropical Island Tropics, but just can't see it. So <laughs> it's silent. Okay. Just not there. We got it. <laughs> Much love, Crypto Tropic. Crypto Tropic. Tropical Crypto. Okay. Tropic. Crypto Tropic. We got it. Crypto Tropics. All right, guys. So, hey, man. Um, so, yeah, we've got some stuff to go over, guys. Um, I definitely appreciate all you guys. Again, appreciate my incredible family. And I, I, here, here's what I want to start. Before we go anywhere else, guys, I have huge, not big, not kind of big. I've got huge goals for this channel. I've got huge aspirations. I've got, and, and, and here's the funny thing about it. I know that I can't do this alone. I don't even want to try to do it alone. I know that it takes incredible, incredible leadership. In everything that I've ever done, all the things that I've ever accomplished, I've always had incredible leaders around me, incredible people. I've always been, you know, if, if I've always had, if I've always, if I've ever had a certain talent, it's keeping people around me like John Singh, Ryan Luth, right? Uh, all the people that you guys have met through this channel is keeping great people around me, like Timeless and Oculus and all the amazing uh, um, um, uh, mods, admins, and just people in this group, guys. Uh, all you guys, and you're incredible, from your Dorays to your Shane Sullivan to your Crypto Tropics. Got it. Told you I was going to get it. <laughs> I'm probably forgetting tomorrow. It's okay. Probably forget it by the 6 p.m. stream if, if there's one. <laughs> Dominique Scott knows I'm talking about, and I, and I definitely appreciate the conversations with people like Dominique. Just... You know, you just never know how amazing people are. And, that, and that's that's the thing, guys. I don't ever want to seem like I'm out of reach. I know there's a time that we may get so big that it's going to be hard for me to to talk to everybody. Right. But it's the it's the core. You're, you're good. I'm used to both. Uh, um, so. So, you know, but, you know, it's, it's going to take leaders stepping up, guys. And I'm just looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to a, a, an amazing 2023. I was just talking to Dave this morning um, and I was telling him that 
Uh, thanks, my brother Dave. Uh, let, me, let me say thank you. I know he's working right now and always always helping out even when he's working. Um, but uh, what I was trying to say is, you know, it, it's it's um, yeah, it's gonna it's gonna take an, an incredible uh, effort going into twenty twenty three, guys. And and I just know the, that the way that we're gonna be able to do that is with the right people in place. And I want I want to push people into the spotlight. This is not about. Me, myself, and I, this is team. That's all I've ever known. That's how I built my entire business. That's how I've, that's how I built everything that I've ever built in my life is, is teamwork makes the dream work. So with that being said, let me just say shouts out, kudos, and much love to all you guys. Uh, uh, absolutely, Dominique Scott. I appreciate those those talks, man, because you know you really don't know what a person's about till you get to you know, meet them. Otherwise, it's just a name on the screen. And I'm not saying I'm going to have personal conversations with everyone. Gmail, what's up, Gmail Brown? My brother, what's up, Gmail with the peace sign? My brother, my brother. Um, and so, yeah, so, but, but it, it is wonderful knowing, um, and getting to know you guys on, you know, and every, every situation is going to be different, but I have had an amazing time getting to know everybody, their stories that helps me through the interviews, like the interviews that we've had, you know, timeless was on the interview, uh, uh Oculus, you know, and then seeing pe people's skill set outside of just a name, right? Finding out what Dominic's passion is in crypto, finding out Oculus skill set, you know, in, in, in NFTs, finding out. Uh, uh, timeless story and why she's on her journey. I mean, all these things are important, guys, and and I always want to be that guy that's that's connected to the family and 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 uh, and, and ideas. You know, uh, and we have a, we have a group where those ideas can be shared very openly and very honestly, and and uh, and that's the kind of person I want to be, leading by example. Whoa, Doray in the house, and my beautiful queen Jeanette is in the house with the super chat. And you know what, guys? I always got to give kudos because people work hard for what they have. Uh, including myself, including myself, and and we've done a lot of giveaways, even dating back to my co-hosting days and, and other groups. We've done a lot of giveaways, and there was never anything intended by those giveaways other than the fact that it was a blessing. It was paying it forward. It was saying thank you, not to a particular person, just saying you know what, you know, uh, uh, I want to share. I want to I want to do for others, and and I want others to smile. And and it's the, it's the same. You know, thought process. If I see someone on the side of the road that's hurting, and, and, and there's a little something we can do, or something for that young man uh, uh, in basketball, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, Travon, and, and just whatever it may be, guys. So I definitely appreciate you guys. Definitely appreciate all the love and uh, shout outs to the greatest, the greatest. And I say that not to be biased, but the greatest group of people that I've ever been a part of on YouTube, uh, Telegram, in crypto. I've got some superstars, and I'm super excited about the superstars that we have on this team. So with that being said, guys, let me throw some really quick crypto tells music as we celebrate Dore, Enginet, Super Chats. Thank you, sis. Thank you, sweetheart. We appreciate you. Show your love. Tails, can you lead in that? Thank you. Few currency was created to deceive the masses. Swifted out of the world. Greatest team ever. Does it like it is? Got them switching gears in Ferrari with the tents on some bullet shit. Stop crying. And always remember, greatest team is not based off of what you give; it's based off of what you do, who you are, uh, all the little things uh, that that you know take uh, that that takes away from your life in some shape, way, or form. Like you know, just a simple like. When I sit back and I read a name and I see crypto. Tropic. Oh, got it again. I told you I was gonna get it. See, I almost said tro trip, crypto traffic. I'm being stupid. Uh, and, and I see that like, or I see timeless taking time off her vacation to send me a comment. Hey, bro, I think. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Or Oculus. Yes, I think this is that. Or or Dominique. Hey, bro, how you doing, man? How's the family? All those things mean the world. You know, seeing you guys hit the likes, the comments, the retweets, and I know that sounds weird, but that that took some kind of effort. You didn't have to do that. It took an effort, and I'm just saying I appreciate you. That's all I'm saying. Thank you, guys. So with that being said, guys, we got a lot to talk about. Let's look at the market. Thank you, sweetheart. Appreciate you. Love you so much. Um, and Dore, appreciate you, sis. So here we go. Let's look at the market. Right now, our overall market cap is $810 billion. Nothing exciting to talk about. It's been ranging from 790 something all the way to like 815 I think, is what we've seen. So not a whole lot going on, guys. And I'm going to be honest with you. The sentiment right now in the market, guys, is... 2023 is going to tell, it's going to be a tell-all, right? And it's funny because I'm seeing more and more people with a bearish mindset, the same people who were calling out, oh, we're going to hit 100K uh, next month. I'm sorry, next next year. 
And these people were yelling this out over the last 30 to 60 days, and now they're changing their tune. Matter of fact, I caught one guy, and, and again, nothing against this person, but I think he was the top five crypto personalities in all of Twitter. Or you, was it Twitter? He was voted top five or something. I'm going to show, show it in a little bit. So uh, but the sentiment again, guys, was $810 billion. Uh, right now. Uh, Bitcoin is sitting around the uh, same price. Nothing's changed. You got 16, 8 and some change. Ethereum, just over 12. By, by, a, by a, you know, just by a little bit. BNB, under, uh, under 250 at 242. XRP's got something going on now. Hey, XRP's got, you know, and here's the thing, guys. A couple of cents here and there. There's nothing, nothing to get crazy about, but it's going more to the up than the down. We had three for a dollar here just uh, last week, but we're sitting at 36 cents. I think there might be some some uh, news. I know there was something that I posted in my group about XRP um, um, uh, doing some things in a different country as far as their payment system. So, you know, a lot of times, you know, the news, you know, what they say, buy the rumor, sell the news. But there's some news going on that I think that has this thing pumped a little bit. And then anytime you get Bitcoin kind of moving sideways or just small capitulation, but steadily kind of in a sideway pad sideways pattern, it allows altcoins to pump sometimes. Depends what the sentiment is. Dogecoin at 7 cents, Cardano at 26 cents. Uh, Polygon back over 80 just by a hair. Uh, uh, Polkadot still right around that four and some change. Uh, if anybody, you know, for, for those who love Litecoin, you're at $70. Uh, Tron at 5 cents. Shiba Inu still five zeros and an eight. Solana still under $12. Uniswap at 520. Uh, we don't have a whole lot really going on, guys. If you look at this Avalanche 1163, Chainlink, uh, just right at $6. Could go either way. Uh, based off the market sentiment, and we have uh, Stellar at seven cents, Chronos at five and a half, getting almost back up to six. Uh, and uh, let's see, V Chain at one cents. Uh, we got Algorand at seventeen. We've got um, Falcoin. Uh oh, I think we're gonna be talking about that at two ninety nine, and then uh, Multiverse X at thirty three point seven four. So I know there's a couple coins people like looking at, so we will take a gander. We'll take a gander. So XRP net just at 003 could possibly go higher or lower, just depend on, again on the sentiment. One of the things that I did want to talk about is when you look at the trending coins, what's trending at number four? Uh oh. Could it be the coin that we're actually talking about today? File coin trending at number four? Why is that? Hmm. Let's find out. Shiba at number two. I'm oh, sorry, number three. Pancake cake swap at uh Pancake swap at um, number two and the number one trending coin right now, Polygon. Poly. We like that Polygon. So uh, looking at uh, our, our coin of the uh, of the day or the topic of the day is file coin sitting at 299. Uh, up just a tad bit, not a whole lot, guys. Uh, but the 37 rank coin. And I remember there's a lot. Of, one of the things that, you know, obviously it's not one of those things that, you know, it's got a bunch of zeros and everybody, oh, show us the, you know, one with all the zero. But, it's, but, you know, we're going to. Uh, talk about a little bit of everything. We're not going to just be talking about, you know, uh, uh, um, um, coins with a lot of potential upside. We're going we're gonna to cover everything. And I think Filecoin is something that is very, very important. It's a, it's a, it's a big project. Um, I do know there's a lot of companies out there um, that hold this, uh, even part of their, you know, like micro, uh, micro strategy, some of their bigger portfolio holdings, or they have this in their portfolio, uh, from what I understand, Filecoin. So it's definitely a coin that uh, you have some institutional players looking at as well, and uh, something I hold as well. Ain't that right, timeless? So that market cap is about to go down even further, in my opinion. Just to be re uh, just be ready and know your plan and what you are wanting to do uh, in this asset class. Absolutely, excuse me. Yes, you're right, timeless. Sis, Matic is trained because of Frank Degas and his news. Okay, okay, see, timeless knows. You want to know Thomas knows one of our admin mods in the group. You better believe it. That's why she's in that position. Okay, guys, so check this out. So uh, speaking of which, let's go take a look before we get into that. Let's take a look at. Okay, so this is one of the guys here. Um, <laughs> he said, Would you buy more Bitcoin if it was a thousand dollars? If it crashed to a thousand? Yeah, um, but, you know, don't know if that's going to happen. Uh, but again, don't know if it don't know if it will or won't. Who knows? I don't know. what This is the guy I was talking about. Uh, I got one of his posts uh, on on my uh, on my Twitter. A lot of these guys were, oh man, you know, you can see um, 100,000 Bitcoin by two, 2020. This is what they were saying in November. Now it's could it go to you know? And again, I, I, I think you know, I think he does this for probably just clicks and likes and stuff like that. But there are, there are some things that I'll show you further than that. Notorious Big, he's back. 
Tupac, you can see guys that they have a lot of um, stuff like this, a lot of these things going on where, where you can go catch like Notorious B.I.G. and these guys in virtual uh, concerts. That's kind of cool, guys. If you ever been a big fan of these guys, like I had, a, I had a great time. Oh, me and my wife just went to go see the Whitney movie. Loved it. You know, it's it's just crazy when you look at like the Whitney movie. You look at like the uh, uh, what was the other one, Elvis movie. Uh, it's just crazy because you know we don't really know what these people go through. Um, it's kind of like you know we also watched uh, last night when we got home. We watched the uh, you know which we already seen it before the Tina Turner. You know, and it's just crazy when you see the lives of these people and the things they had to go through. So uh, Whitney was definitely a sad, uh, you know, a great movie, but just some of the things you're like, oh man, you, you know, your heart goes out. And even Elvis, I think Elvis was one of the biggest shockers for me, knowing that he had to go through some of the things he went through. But both great movies, uh, you know, check it out if you get a chance. Uh, okay, so right here, it talks, this is what I was telling you about, maybe with the ripple pump. Uh, Palu's president, not really sure, uh, says the country is working with uh, Ripple to explore the creation of a national stable coin. So, you know, Ripple's got things going, even though they're still in that, you know, in that suit waiting to see what's going to happen. They're still doing that thing. We're going to get into Filecoin in a minute. Let's go over a couple other things here. It says this year has been a tough one for crypto. And while the industry had some good moments, there has been plenty of episodes that traders will want to wipe from their memories. Here are some of them. So you can open up this, guys, and it talks about the seven bit collapses, obviously going from, you know, uh, Luna and, and um, Celsius and Voyager and BlockFi and FTX. I opened it up real quick and took a quick little sneak peek, but that's pretty much what, what it's going over. Uh, more stuff here about, um, I love Michael Sayers' uh, little uh, Bitcoin um, art that he was, he's always potent, posting, posting like almost every day. Uh, I like this too. I kind of read through this a little bit. It says how to avoid bull traps. I think this is kind of good for anybody that's looking to jump in and out of the market. Again, I, I would be very careful with this, but if you're a trader, or if you're personally, you know, trying to take some profits or whatever, uh, whatever along the way, this is definitely some good stuff. You know, you know, what is, you know, a, a bull trap in trading? What is a bull trap in trading? Um, how does a bull trap work? You know, all this stuff is good because it kind of gives you an idea of how, how there's people out there trying to take your money, guys. And, and it's a very manipulated industry. And it talks about a lot of this. And it gives you the breakdown of the definitions of these things. You know, what does a bull trap mean in, in the crypto market? It's just, it, I kind of skimmed through it real quick and thought, of, you know, these are things that I had to learn coming up in trading, you know, uh, so, so much terminology. But this is definitely a good read. Uh, you know, what causes bull trap, how to identify it, you know, uh, all that stuff. This is just really good stuff here. Um, you know, it talks about, you know, just suspicious, huge bullish candlesticks and just, you know, the manipulation of the market and all those things. So good, good little read, guys. You'll find this on my Twitter. That's right. Uh, so you got all the stuff here. Uh, let's see here. Oh, this is not me. Let me go back. I don't know how I got into that one probably because I went in here. Okay. Uh, let's see. Again, it, you know, my boy Crypto Savvy, if you haven't had an opportunity to go check out my boy Crypto Savvy 1 on Twitter, Crypto Savvy 1 on YouTube. Uh, this is him talking about reminder. This is just a reminder. You know, so you don't don't say I didn't tell you. And this guy's been yelling this since December of last year. Um, you know, we're still in this pattern. The trend is your friend until otherwise invalidated. Right? The trend is your friend, guys. We're stuck in this trend. Even, you know, couple few weeks ago, got up to 18 people. Oh my God, you know, doing the Tootsie Roll. I don't know what you've been told. It's not the butterfly, it's the Tootsie Roll. And they were doing that little dance and everything. I was like, stop it. We're going back. <laughs> Let me stop. So just saying, guys, be careful with that. Grayscale uh, going bankrupt. Now, I don't know what this is about. I did share it, um, but that would be horrific, you know, because again, um, it, it's just something, not only is it bad for, uh, you know, crypto, but a lot of it would probably be played out into uh, the fact that they have uh, big crypto position. So if they went down, it's just saying, you know, could that mean five? I just think there's a lot of things. It won't be a grayscale thing or a money printing thing or a recession, I mean, you know, or, a, you know, real estate market. You know, it's going to be a, a combination of a lot of things. It's not just going to be an FTX thing or Celsius or, you know, it's going to be a bunch of things. I think that's going to get us there, but I think we're going to get there. Ain't that right? Timeless. The dead can bounce. The dead can, they actually talk about that dead cat, cat bounce is that relief bounce that so many get excited uh, about saying we are going back bull, uh, bull. Laugh my A off, uh, makes me laugh every time. That's right, Thomas. You already know. She knows. 
AKA Adele. Yeah, they got so they got some good that's a good little read there on that on that uh, deal if, for people who want to understand. Uh oh, who's this? Well look guys, memes, you we're in a meme contest right now. <laughs> good lord. What did they do to my teeth? I look like that uh what's that movie that just came out not too long ago? Smile, when you knew you were in trouble when the when the person got up and they had the like the big old smile up and you uh oh, I'm about to die in that movie. So <laughs> they gave me the smile look. Uh the rest of it is is is, is definitely amazing. Shout outs to uh Wacky with this one. Um, uh, got Jeanette over there blinking and did a great job on my baby. She looks great, hair swinging in the end. Oh, I'm beautiful and I'll be, mm, you know, that kind of say my, my queen makes me want to go give her a kiss right now. She's so pretty. But um, yeah, they did something with my teeth. I think if I had those teeth, my wife probably would have been looking at me like, uh, you know what, uh, bro, close your mouth. <laughs> cool little mean guys. Shout outs to Wacky again. Uh, got the glasses, the Ray Bans uh, gleaming. Boy, the teeth, that smile. They gave me that. <laughs> oh, Lord. Christmas, Santa with a smile. Uh, <laughs> uh, says no, she said, boy, they, they put in some dentists, whatever those call them, they put the teeth in, you know, too white. Um, I guess that'd have been better than being buttery or something, right? Let me stop. Uh, it's, uh, it looks like Shiba and Doge are two cryptocurrencies that are uh, on a lot of people's minds lately. You know, people, yeah, of course, right? People thinking, man, if I can just open up that Doge or that, you know, if I can get enough Doge and Shiba, it changes everything. I'm just saying, like like Timeless just said, be careful. You know, and, there, and, and one of the sentiments right now, guys, in the market, there's a lot of people who feel like, again, this is not financial advice. Nothing ever said on this channel is financial advice. Even as I talk about file, this is just me covering for entertainment purposes only. We're not telling you to buy it, hold it, hodl it, nothing, right? Uh, but one of the sentiments that I see out there in the market right now, guys, is people saying that... Um, hodling right now can be very dangerous, right? Now, I do hodl certain coins, but, um, you know, if people in a group feel a certain way about that, you know, because all they're saying is, look, and I think a lot of times what our mindset is we're down. We're down quite a bit from last December. We're down a lot, right? Last year, um, I've got coins that are down a lot, 50 to 90%. Um, and then what happens, the mindset is, well, I'm going to go ahead and hold on to them, and it's possible, excuse me, that those those coins, those positions can go down another you know, 30 to 50 percent uh, if, if everything plays out. Because remember, if Bitcoin does go down uh, pre, you know, pre like a, a pre ten thousand dollar Bitcoin, eight, seven, six, five, whatever it is, whatever it may get to, uh, rem you know, just understand that a lot of your positions are not going to hold strong <laughs> waiting for Bitcoin to go down and come back up. They're going to go down as well. So, uh, again, not financial advice, just something to keep in mind as that is the sentiment right now in the market. OK. So, um, and then, you know, this is the same guy that's up above there, Crypto Rover. I think Crypto Rover, they had a, a, a deal here not too long ago where they were talking about the top five uh, crypto or crypto influencers. I think they had some kind of bang that they were doing on, on um, Twitter. And I think he was number five. I was shocked. I was like, whoa, who's this guy? Mm -hmm. So I kind of remember his name. Um, I think, I don't know if that has to do with a lot of posting or whatever, because I know there's people who got bigger numbers than him, mm -hmm. but it, it just must be with... Um, uh, you know, with his posting or whatever the case may be, but I know he was he was ranked at number five. Uh, so, I, if I, you know, it made me kind of look and see what's going on. But anyways, so this guy, you know, I saw some things, you know, a month or so ago, oh, you know, can we hit this? And, and you know, again, it, it just is talking about could we do this and that. But now, you know, this coin comes out and says a uh, huge big Bitcoin crash income. And he's kind of drawn some chart in here and he's showing that, you know, where he thinks it could go and all that good, good stuff. So, you know, people have a change of heart. Uh, again, guys, we still have this crypto meme contest going on to the 30th. That gives us about, what, four days left? So four days left for anybody who, uh, you know, feels artsy. You know, and here's the thing, guys, there's a lot of, because I used to be into like a lot of apps and stuff like that. So I know there's a lot of apps that, that people are using and can get uh, to come up with some really cool memes, like the one that me and Jeanette have with me having that smile, that that those <laughs> that, uh, that, that crazy smile up there. That's an app. That definitely came off of an app. I used that app before. That's how I know. So a lot of great stuff here, guys. This is something that uh, uh, I think it was, uh, I can't, was this Crypto uh, Tropic? Somebody made this in our group. I can't remember who it was. Don't want to give a shout out to the wrong person, but I think that's who that was. So anyways, guys, I think I had some stuff on Filecoin here. That, so I'll start down here because uh, I think I ran out of room, and so it's kind of here and on the top. So let's talk about Filecoin. File Remember, guys, this is just kind of an overview. Um, it's not a deep dive per se. Everyone has to take responsibility to do their own due diligence, their own research, which is what everybody should be doing right now, in my opinion. 
Uh, but let's take a look at file. You guys see it right there. I'm going, huh? What is this? Okay, I know what it is. I got some. Uh, but you can see right here where it says now 294 is obviously gone out since I made this. Uh, it was yesterday. It's up to 299, I think, is what we just saw it was, right? In the trending coin, it popped uh, with a 299, so it's still ranging about, so, you know, a few cents up. Uh, so let's let's get into this real quick, guys. So MetaMask and Filecoin, the new project to create. The new project to create. Let's look at it. I need some more coffee. And by the way, guys, I hope everybody had a Merry Christmas. Hope you guys had a great time with your family. Uh, Jeanette and I had uh, a couple of our girls down. You know, we didn't have all the kids down. We had uh, two of the six kids down. Uh, we saw them all when we went th th to go um, hook up with the young man in that story. Um, but, um, yeah, so my one of my daughters had a really bad, had to go to the hospital, something going on with her throat. And so we had two of them out here. My, my son had to work, and yeah, that's what happens when they start getting grown, man. As, you know, they, but we, we definitely had an opportunity to see them all while we were out in that area. So that was awesome, amazing. So, again, I wish everybody had, wish I uh, hope everybody had a great Christmas and uh that's being very safe as you travel for the new years and things like that okay so let's take a look at this metamask and filecoin the new project to create web3 sites okay let's take a look at it okay let's see metamask has called developers attention to its uh, uh, new upcoming uh upcoming you know what i know what i want to do i know what i messed up on let me stop let me go back i didn't say what what is filecoin what is filecoin that's what i messed up at what is filecoin Okay, here we go, guys. I should have done this first. Filecoin is a decentralized storage system that aims to uh, store humanity's most important information. The project raised $205 million, whoa, in an uh, initial coin offering in 2017 and initially planned to launch planned a launch date for mid-2019. Okay, so this is kind of going back. However, uh, the launch date for Filecoin mainnet was pushed back until block 148,888. Uh, which is expected in okay mid October two. So this is this is old news here. Uh, the project was first described uh, back in two thousand fourteen as an incentive layer uh, for the uh, interplanetary interplanetary uh, file system IPFS, a peer to peer storage network where users pay for data storage and distribution services in file. Okay, which is a, the uh, ticker name for Filecoin F I L. Uh, Filecoin is open is open protocol and backed by a blockchain that records comments made by network's participants with transactions made uh, using file, the blockchain's native currency. Okay, uh, the blockchain base uh, is based on both proof of replication and proof of space time. Filecoin is open source and decentralized, which means that all governance is in the hands of the community. On the Filecoin platform, developers have the opportunity to create cloud uh, file storage services like Dropbox, I use that, iCloud, use that. Anyone can join Filecoin and start storing their data to, uh, or earn money by providing space for someone else's funds. Uh, the creators of Filecoin opt uh, for their blockchain technology to run on the network and their token with their own consensus, with their own consensus, okay. Okay, where he went through that already. Okay, so just kind of tells about files some more information. Now we can get into what is Filecoin. Okay. All right, so going back into this again here. Uh-oh, well, I keep getting all these little pop-ups. Okay, so it says uh, da -da -da. MetaMask has called developers' attention to its new upcoming Filecoin-based project, MetaMask Snaps, for creating dApps, uh, dApps and Web3 sites. Today, th uh, through a tweet, the famous Ether... Ethereum Wallet announced uh, to its followers its secret efforts to offer the new prototype to Filecoin developers. Calling all, okay, calling all Filecoin develop, developers, we've been secretly working uh, a way to provide you with a special MetaMask built uh, build that enables you to build Web3 sites based on Filecoin. Okay, all right, great information. Uh, specifically, uh, this special build of MetaMask is now available to all developers who want to try out the preview, uh, building their own Web3 sites using Filecoin. The testing will then be made official in the next extension system, MetaMask Snaps. Okay, with the next, okay. Uh, okay, let's see here. Although Filecoin Snap is uh, pre-installed in this build, the final product will install the Snap plugin through the Connect flow when a consumer connects to the site that depends on Filecoin. 
uh, there may be breaking changes between now and the production release, and we'll do our best to communicate these regularly. Okay, so some good inf information on the connection between MetaMask and Filecoin. I think a lot of us, especially myself, use MetaMask a lot, or used to a lot, kind of still do. Uh, okay, so here's another one with Consensus uh, Plus Protocol Labs. All right, Protocol Labs uh, collaborates with Consensus to bring, uh, okay, yeah, uh, to bring Filecoin to Ethereum. Okay, with new and upcoming features from Consensus uh, Product Suite, Filecoin miners, developers, and users of the network can now access essential Ethereum tools and integrate the Ethereum's decentralized finance ecosystem. So this is, okay, this is two years ago. So um, Great Read uh, talks about uh, some things going on with them. And so this, this was back in October 2020. Uh, today, Consensus announced a collaboration with Protocol Labs, the open source software laboratory whose projects include interplanetary file systems, IPFS, Filecoin, um, and more. The wide-ranging collaboration seeks to further integrate Filecoin's next-generation marketplace for data storage and retrieval with consensus-leading Ethereum product stack. So again, great information talking about this uh, connection and um, partnership here. And there's a lot. There's a lot on this here. So it looks like that might have been where... Uh, let me see if I got anything in here. Uh oh we're going to the thread. Might be more in this thread here. Okay, Filecoin takes blockchain file into new levels. This dates back to where? Let's take a look. 2012. Okay, so this is this year. Uh, Filecoin takes blockchain file into a new levels with Lockhead Martin partnership. File, Filecoin's partnership with uh, will help uh, the network launch a node into space. What? Okay, so this, this is an interesting read here. A node into space. Let's take a look at what they're talking about here. The World Economic Forum's uh, uh, WEF uh, annual meeting in Davos, Switzerland, is turning out to be a big one for the blockchain. But it's more surprising it's turning out into a big meeting for space technology. Hmm. These two uh, fledging sectors are bridging together this week thanks to, the, uh, to two of the largest players in each uh, respective space. Blockchain player Filecoin, File, we got it, uh, and defense contractor Lockhead Martin. Uh, are teaming up on a project that seeks to improve file sharing in remote locations. Well, I guess space would definitely be a remote location. Good Lord. So the great read on this, guys, you can find this in the Twitter uh, thread. Uh, let's see. Okay, here's another one. So a lot, a lot of stuff. We're going to go through it quickly, guys, so we can get to the drawing and get out of here within an hour or less. Harvard University. Oop, come on, all these blocking things. Okay, come on. Okay, well, you know what? Wants to... Uh, maybe I should be hitting all these accepting. Uh, Harvard University and Filecoin Foundation for the Decentralized Web plan to preserve digital information. And this is when? This is, okay, July, just a few months back, 2022. On July 27th, uh, the Filecoin Foundation for the Decentralized Web, FFDW, announced it will be supporting an initiative with Harvard University Library Innovation, uh, in Innovation Lab, LIL, called the uh, uh, dem uh, Democratizing uh, Open Knowledge Program. With FFDW support, uh, LIL plans to explore decentralized technologies that can preserve, preserve digital information. Okay. So more stuff on this. Great. I mean, anything's going on with uh, Harvard. It's got to be big time, right? Okay. Good stuff. Good news. Let's keep it going. We already talked about that. We talked about this. And what is this one? Uh, Falcoin Green, okay. So they must have a green, like green energy, efficient green. Okay, so this can also be found here. It says uh, Falcoin Green launches uh, CO2 dot storage, the Web3 data storage solution for carbon offsets. Okay, carbon friendly. Okay, you go ahead with your bad self. And this is October 2000, just a couple months ago. Okay, good information. I like this. Uh, it says. Filecoin file, uh, file Green announced today that uh, the launch of CO2 Stores, the first Web3 data storage solution to enable transparency for comprehensive environmental uh, attributes uh, underlining carbon offsets. Uh, this free storage utility aims to address the in insufficiencies of traditional storage solutions for all types of digital environment assets, including carbon off offsets, renewable energy, 
uh, creditors and others. Filecoin Green is the Protocol Labs initiative to uh, decarbonize the Filecoin network uh, an open source public cryptocurrency and digital payment system which provides blockchain based cooperative digital data storage. Great stuff. Sounds really amazing. So, shout outs to Bullish Big D and to Oculus, who I believe sent all this information to me. The legends are in the house. Okay, let's see, Falcon. Okay. Uh, it has it. Okay, so here's another one here. Uh, Fal Falcon has it. Uh, an ecosystem overview. So this kind of gives a little overview of Filecoin. Um, data availability and uh, integrity. This is all good stuff. So make sure you guys go there. This is again all into uh, in the thread that's on my Twitter. So yeah, I won't get too much in this because I know we got a lot to cover. What's in here? also follow coin to open up so okay yeah amd seagate and uh ey join protocol labs led decentralized storage alliance okay so they got some they got some big stuff going on guys accelerating file coins adoption in the bear market okay this is september 22 okay so this is an event that just passed not too long ago so they got a lot of stuff you can, i mean there's obviously a reason why they're ranked what did i say again Number 37. So, again, this, this is not saying buying guys, go out and buy or nothing like that. It's just, you know, great information for entertainment purposes only. Let me grab some coffee. Let me get a little coffee. Before we continue, Oculus Vision in the house smiling. Dore is always smiling. Nothing much writing up on this research paper and listening. So, we see uh, Oculus, Timus, Laurel, Quintessentials in the house. Quintessentials in the house. Timeless Travel says, Wall File and their partnerships that are being secured uh, are uh, really lending the hand of showing that they may be one of the ones that will be here in the long term, in my opinion. I second that, sis. Beekeeper69, what's up, my man? Crypto OG, I have a bag of Filecoin. Yeah, I got some too. Sidecoin, I got some of that too. Not financial advice. Don't you, anyone dare buy this based off of that. Tell them, PDP Real. He knows. Well, if PDP real knows. It really comes down if you're an asset long term, short term, because there's also tax implications for cashing out in the short term. True that. True that. A lot of great. You see, we've got a lot of smart people out here, guys. A lot of smart people in the group. Lots of smart people. I like them a lot in my. Who did I say that voice was? I can't remember. Uh, I thought it was Forrest Gump, but it's actually, I think it was Jim Carrey. All right, guys. So another great read here. Um, Protocol Labs, the company behind the decentralized file sharing protocol Filecoin, announced an alliance that aims to help more companies make the transition to Web3 and Web2. All good information. The industry organization has a trio of heavy hitters as found, founding partners, computer hardware giant, advanced micro devices, AMD storage device maker, Seagate, and Big Fork accounting and consulting firm, Ernest and Young. I like the name. All right, guys, so another great article here. You can see this was kind of updated. I like this. Um, let's see this going here. We got the giveaway to do here soon. Okay, so we got from Bullish Big D. You can see who these come from, actually, right? Okay, Bullish Big D went crazy. A lot of this is Bullish Big D. I see, I see, I see. My brother. Thank you, my brother. Uh, Protocol Labs here. Um, all this stuff is just great read, guys. A lot of information here. Decentralized Stor Storage Alliance launches to bridge uh, between Web3 and Web2. Uh, a lot of good information, a lot of great reads, guys. Make sure you go through all this again. This is about doing your own research, not to themselves. Let me see what 68J said. Let me see what Bullish Big D did. Let me see what Oculus put up. Let's see what Time was talking about. Let's see what Bullish PDP Real, or, and, and let me just go out there and buy. Nuh uh. That's not what it's about. Mm mm. We, uh -uh. we don't push that here. We push do your own research, study, 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 study. Okay, here we go. Uh, partners Protocol. Okay, so here's another great article here. Uh, Lee Hertz partners with Protocol Labs to work on Filecoin's major projects. A uh, lot of great information. You guys can just see there's so much stuff that was sent out by Bullish Big D. Polygon and Filecoin. Oh my goodness. Wasn't Polygon number one trending? And then Filecoin number four? Polygon Matic and Filecoin. Stop it. Don't know me. I'm just start doing that. Uh, Polygon Matic and Filecoin increases collaboration to integrate into metaverse and NFT space. They got a lot of stuff going on, guys. A lot of stuff going on. Number 37. We like it. 
We like it. So great read here as well, guys. Oh, look at this guy. He's excited. Yuri says, two major crypto platforms have announced a partnership to accelerate growth in the fears, uh, in the spheres of NFT games and metaverse. Uh-oh. Uh, Chinese, uh, Chinese crypto. Okay. Uh, poly, deep, deep, okay. Uh, Polygon deepens integration with Filecoin. As part of the partnership, Filecoin and Polygon have begun to create grant and hackathons in order to assist dev teams and NFT projects that use Polygon blockchain to integrate with Filecoin and Interplanetary File Systems, IPFS. Polygon is one of the so-called Ethereum killers that have been attempting to solve ETH block bottlenecks. ETH bottlenecks. Like high gas fees and slow validation transaction, it has become popular with NFT projects and DLT game makers. That's right. Thomas knows. Thomas knows. Thomas says, yes, do not invest your fiat into any project, project that you hear from someone else. Do your own research, right? People uh, says, do, the, uh, do that research, people, and if you do not know how to dig in there uh, a deep, then ask somebody. That's right. See why she is who she is. Big Bro 10, what's up? Big Bro 10, what's up, my brother? Big Bro 10's in the house. Uh-oh, crypto tells, yo, 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 yo. Okay, so, uh, okay, let's go, let's see, I think that's that's it on that one, so let's go to the very top of this, and you guys can see that was the first, that was a, uh, the actually second part, and uh, if you go into, uh, let's see, go here, go here, if you go here, you'll see there's a whole nother thread here with a bunch of stuff in it as well, right, so this is uh, uh, New, uh, Newton Ta uh, Newtown, uh, partners brings Filecoin to Africa. Uh oh, you know I gotta open this up. Africa. Okay. Uh, Newtown Partners brings Filecoin to Africa with exclusive launch party. Uh oh, they got a party going on, and we didn't get invited. What? When, when was this? Probably missed the party already. Let's see. I'm always missing some. Uh, this is uh, December 26th. Oh, we could have made the party. What in Africa? <laughs> I gotta renew my passport. Let me stop. Uh, admit an explosion in data and a rise in archive storage data uh, solution costs. Venture capital firm Newton Partners will host the in, uh, inaugural Filecoin Africa launch. James didn't get an invi uh, invitation party. The largest gathering of Filecoin community in Africa to date to profile an alternative solution. The event takes place November 15th. Oh, okay. In Cabo. In Cabo, in Cape Town, South Africa. That'd have been a dope place to go. I know that. We're gonna start trying to go to more and more places involving crypto. Africa would've been amazing. So great read, guys. Uh, make sure you check that out. Got a lot of stuff here to cover before we get into the drama, which we're running out of time here. Uh, uh, Leeway Hertz partners with Protocol Labs to work on Filecoin major projects. Let's see here. That's right. So another great read here, guys. So much information on this coin. Um, I can tell you that I definitely like this coin. I'm not telling you to buy it. I'm telling you not to buy it, but I'm telling you I actually do have this. Protocol Labs, Filecoin, I think we went through that. We actually went through this again. So this is stuff I must have posted more than once. Filecoin has it. We posted this as well. Uh, Green Grant uh, awarded prestigious Filecoin Green Grant. Okay, so this talks more stuff about Green uh, Grant Program uh, to Propel Web3 Interoperability Announce. Oh, Filecoin and Hera hash. Okay, wait a minute. What's the what's the ticker for this? Is that uh, I think I got this too. Let's see here. How do you spell it? Oh. Let me go back and find out what was this uh, hash graph. Uh, Hedera. Okay. What is the ticker for that? I know that coin. Hedera. What am I at here? Oops. H bar. Okay, dang it. Well, I'm getting old. <laughs> H bar. I like H bar. Okay. I know I knew that. I was like, I know that name from somewhere. Yeah. H bar. Okay. Uh, today, Filecoin and Hedera Hashgraph are announcing a joint effort to advance the interoperability of Web3, starting with a $200,000 grant program and an initial demo implement, uh, implementation of NFT use cases. Uh, the long-term vision is a full range of distributed ledger solutions, including distributed consensus, storage, and smart data applications that combine the strength of both networks. Okay, so they got stuff going on with some major players. Yes. 
Yeah, we hold we hold this as well. Okay. I like it. I like it. Okay, guys. So a lot of great information. Thank you again. Bye. If not mistaken, bullish big D, Oculus. Thank you. Appreciate you guys. Polygon again. We talked about that. And the flag. Who is that? Who's that holding that up? So definitely a bullish on that as well. So Filecoin guys, uh, there goes your light overview real quick, guys. Let me do some more shout outs before we get into our giveaway, our drawing, which will be this Friday. Tails. Gmail Brown. H-Bar, that's right, H-Bar. That's H-Bar. Yeah, we have some H-Bar. So let's go into Tails real quick. Start buying, getting bags. I ain't lying. 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 I'm so tired of this crypto control. You already know, basically, let money go. Swimming in the dough as you see gets exposed. Tomorrow's the day we gon' blow. You never go wrong with Tails. A little Tails in the house. Thomas said, that's H-Bar. Always got my back, sis. There's so many things that. Uh, should be researched before diving into a project like knowing MC and uh, know how uh, even the highest uh, a coin can logically go. Yeah, don't let the hype. Yeah, that's right. Don't let the hype tell you otherwise. Don't get caught up in the FOMO. That's right, Gmail Brown. He knows. Mr. Subsell, that's right. All right, guys, so here we go. Oculus, big bro. Here we go. All right, guys, let's get into the giveaway. So, for those of you guys who haven't tuned in right now, here goes the wheel. The wheel has bullish Kenny G and timeless on it. So we're looking for one, two, three, four, five more people. And then Friday, probably Friday evening, if, unless for some crazy reason something happens. I'm sorry, guys. Hold on one second. One second. Let's see. Sound like somebody's on my roof. Give me a second, guys. One second. Give me a second. One second, guys. I got to pause out for one second. Hold on one second. Let me figure out what that is. Once in a lifetime, someone comes in your life, catches you off guard. You weren't expecting it. You don't think you deserve it. You know you don't deserve it. But oh, do you love it. Walking to Costco, trying to get some snacks That's when I saw the brunette that was stacked Heart skipped a beat and I became flush Tried to form words but I just turned to mush Asked them for help and I act like I'm lost Asked where the salad is cause I need it tossed Broccoli in my teeth so they mention the floss Love is under attack like a server getting DDoS Ask what time it is just like a sundial Pulls out his phone with a bashful smile Now that it's out I can add my number so and go on a trip and run away this summer I burned so many calories for him Walk miles, swipe him right Always on his profile got stuff going on <laughs> Watch on the roof He says some ninjas on the roof Hey, they don't want to come on my roof Uh-uh, not on mine Alright guys, so, so the giveaways will be this Friday uh, We'll draw the last name at 12 uh, p.m. And then um, it'll either be Friday evening or Saturday morning I'm thinking Friday evening unless something just happens But it should be for Oh! Almost forgot. Oh, my goodness. Who, who just reminded me? Nobody says so Shane Sullen. That's why we're here. Twenty six eight and other, other members. Man, we got the greatest family ever, Shane Sullivan. Look at all those legends. Just you got, I hope you guys don't mind. I got to play this. Just, this is for you guys and the legends that you are. Love this family. Love you guys. Oh, I'm better off from selling at a loss, not caring what it costs. I ain't when it drop, waiting for the flip flop to the tip top. Why you watching TikTok? So my new wristwatch hit that Vegas crypto meter. Hello, nice to meet you. Yeah. Shower D A I like we do it all the time. Let us show with Lady E in the bag, man. The next night, a moon party, so you know we have to. Take I just love being around great people. I'm sorry, I got excited. Let me get back to the drawing. So the drawing guys will be this Friday. Uh, what that prize is gonna be? I'm still trying to figure that part out. Don't know that yet. We'll see. We'll let you know. So what we're doing is we're drawing names, a name a day, until we get to Friday, and then boom, we're going to make it happen. So let's get to the drawing. Let's do it. Let's do it. So guys, we got a lot of, let me get over here to the drawing. We got a lot of interesting things that will be coming up. Um, a lot of ideas that a lot of our top people in the group, um, admin and mods are uh, sharing with me some things to help the channel grow so we're going to be implementing a lot of things i just let me just first say how appreciative and thankful i am guys we've been at this for just over a month i think if you go to youtube if i go to youtube and look 
at my first, I just want to see, because I keep saying a month, but how long has it been? Let me see. It would have been my very first live, right? And that was, was that a month ago? One month ago. So when we did our first, it give, does it give an actual date? Uh, it doesn't, it just says a month ago. So I know it was, okay, so our first test stream. You know, probably wouldn't even get to like. Let me see, what was that? What date? Does it show the date on this? The very first test stream? Does it show? I just know it was a month ago. And so, um, was it whether it's a month and a day, I was hoping it was going to give me like a date, but I don't see a date. It's okay. It's okay. But I know we've been at this for about a month. And so, all I'm saying is an appreciation for all you guys. Um, thank you. Just thank you. Oh, got choked up. Uh, need some more coffee. But no, uh, thank you very much, guys, uh, for all you do. Thank you for embracing uh, who I am, my family, my wife. Um, my goals, my mindset, and just embracing the vision of Crypto for Life. And uh, Crypto for Life is you. You know, I, I want to grow with you. I want to uh, embrace your ideas. I want to find extraordinary people that will help this this thing grow overall. And uh, and we've got some incredible leaders. So I'm just, I'm really thankful. Really, I'm, I think I'm feeling really grateful right now. It's the whole holiday spirit, you know, and just uh, pre appreciate you guys. That's all I got to say. Let me move on. Don't want to start crying. Let me stop. Okay. All right, guys. So let's see here. Let's get to where I can do the giveaway right here. Turn this down, turn, turn this down. Okay, here we go, guys, let's do it. All right, guys, let's do it. Here we go, can you guys hit C4L, 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 let's do it, C4L. C4L, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say uh, hello to everybody while you guys putting C4L, uh, C4L in. Laurel Jack, Wheel of Fortune, that's right. Uh, Crypto, uh, Crypto Brown, Doray, appreciate you. Uh, Gmail Brown, what's up, my man? Uh, let's see who else. Shane Sullivan, appreciate you. Crypto Tropic. <laughs> I got it right. Crypto Tropic, what's up? Uh, guys, appreciate each and every one of you guys. Timeless Travel, Sis, Oculus, Vision, Crypto Tales, my brother, Mr. Bars. I'm going to start calling him Crypto Tales, a.k.a. Mr. B Mr. Bars. Crypto OG, what's up, my man? <laughs> let's just stop selling. What's up? Uh, Big Bro 10, what's up, my man? Okay, here we go, guys. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get this going. Take flight. So many years and it's still no tears. The fear's selling and I'm still on here. What do you do when your freedom is an illusion? How high will it go when the XRP get the moon in? It's amusing when you know that you ain't losing. Going back to gold back up. Which one? SLM? Bag it up. This one? Bag it up. Bag it up. Pull up in a spacecraft and bags on us. Get into them bags with them stacks on us. In a different bracks where they try to tax on us. Government some lies, but them bags blowing up. Spitting six right, guys, get bags stuffed up. Give you more game than your mainstream rap buzz. Told you get the bag, disconnect from the fuzz. Right, if guys, ever I rap phone, then he can't be trust. Move to a different code so they can't tax us. Golden path. The only thing I didn't say in this whole stream is make sure you hit those likes, subscribe. Support us on Twitter. Show you love. We got some big plans, guys. I'm actually looking forward to not only more giveaways um, after this meme contest. We're going to be having a, um, uh, a crypto logo uh, contest, right? So a logo for Crypto for Life. Uh, we're going to be having more people. I've got guests already lined up going into the new year. Uh, maybe maybe before the end of the year, I might have one. Uh, but definitely got some going into the new year uh, based on people's schedule. A uh, lot of great things. I'm looking to inject a lot of... Uh, um, Investing, I'm gonna invest uh, into this channel, getting this thing on the next level, uh, and we're gonna we're gonna continue to have fun with this thing, guys. So I appreciate you guys. Again, hit the like, subscribe. Appreciate you guys. Show your love on YouTube and Twitter. Here we go. Passports, rocket ships like Buzz. We light years ahead of the herd, like uh. They don't want you to get rich, but die trying. But I slid you the crypto list, so start buying, and I'll see you at the tip, tip top when we start flying. Upgrade the ship, push a button out on pilot. Party all night, Looks so like we just Jack. keep flying. Looks like Lil Jack. 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 Lil Go back, got him choosing. Get one, hey. Bag it up. Here come the monkeys. Let me get yeah. some. We're looking for that astro flip. Guacamole, I'm going to see it right there. So, I got my space suit next on. Friday, yeah. we've already got three names. We need four more names. We got Laurel Jack, Timeless, Bullet, Kenny G. We do Four more people to go. Let's go. Over on a yeah, that works right there, guys. We're in the jungle. So, I know. They like monkeys. I'm excited, guys. Appreciate you guys. I did my homework, so he don't care. Yeah. 
sitting on a ledger with one thing i forgot to mention guys tomorrow we're going to go see the golden state warriors versus the charlotte hornets nba basketball game in san francisco so uh what what time the stream will be i'm sure we're not going to be leaving that early so i'm for sure for sure should be having a noon how do you do that? For sure, for sure, should be. <laughs> That's not, you can't even put those two. I had to catch myself. For sure, for sure, should be, maybe. It's possible, guaranteed. <laughs> Let me stop. That sounds stupid, even when I said it. That's right, Laurel Jet. We're going to go see him tomorrow. That's right. NBA, and, and guys, I'm going to definitely do some pictures and videos and, and coverage while we're out there uh, so that you guys can check out you know, what we're seeing and all that good stuff. I know when we went to the Lakers game, like we saw Kevin Hart and everybody was like right there and the Kardashians, like boyfriend and all that, whatever my wife was calling. Oh, there's that person. There's uh, Tyga. And I was like, okay, whatever. I'm here to see the game. <laughs> but no, guys, so we, we expecting a, a really good, um, it, it should be a lot of fun tomorrow. And uh, I'll do my uh, uh, best to take video and, uh, and some um, uh, pictures for you guys as well. So uh, appreciate you guys. Much love to you guys. Uh, so tomorrow at noon definitely won't be, and I'll get back to the PM um, streams as well. What we're doing, you know, sometimes we'll do two a day, sometimes we might do noon, sometimes we might do six. But my my hope and goal, as I was talking to Dave, is to start. We might even actually do it after the stream. We start recording like five, ten, or fifteen minute just overviews of things, right? Looking at certain subjects and talking about that for five to ten minutes and posting it. So we're gonna have lives and we're also going to have a lot of little recorded things five minute ten minute streams going uh, uh video recordings going out about certain things so that way you know i might get off the live right now see something that's hot now and don't want to have to wait till tomorrow to talk about it so uh that allows me to kind of get on record uh, some of it might be uh here in the studio some might be be uh via uh cell phone or whatever uh mobily whatever the case may be but we're gonna uh, definitely do uh more to uh bring a lot more uh, information as it's happening uh, to you guys quickly through uh, pre-recorded videos and things like that as well. So with that being said, thank you guys. Much love. Make sure you hit those likes, subscribe, show your love on the Twitter. I'm going right into the Telegram after this. Show your love there. YouTube. Guys, I'm only as great. This will only be this vision that we have in helping, giving back, and being extraordinary and being one of the best in the market only happens with you. With that being said, guys, God bless you. I appreciate you. Much love. Prayers out to Bulla Sharon and her loss. We, we're so sorry for you, Bulla Sharon. You're in our prayers. With that being said, greatest family ever. Love you guys. Your boy, 6AJ. We out. Peace.